Welcome to eWebStyle Sevo website analysis. That's when we do um, an analysis of your website to figure out two things. Um, how it's optimized for search engine placement and how is it optimized for search engine visitors once they come to your site. Conversions. How do you get that? You go to e-webstyle.com. Fill out the free website analysis form on the right. Uh, we'll get the submission and if we choose yours, we'll do an analysis on your website. Today we're doing one for Bag Buddy. Bag Buddy, um, I did some research on their, their product and their site. Um, interesting product. They have a product that really preserves uh, produce and flowers, plants, vegetables, things like that uh, while being refrigerated. Um, so looking at the site, um, you know, big images, it's clear that they're trying to be a green company, um, but let's talk business. The problem is this is an e-commerce site. They have products for sale, but above the fold you see nothing that says purchase or buy. And matter of fact, the only buy now you do see has money back guarantee bigger than buy now. Um, you see no phone numbers, no, no uh, readily available contact information. What does this mean? This means that as a user, um, I don't have any way to contact you and the product you're selling, um, you're, you're pushing the money back guarantee more than a product. Mm, not really a good idea for somebody who's searching on the web. If we scroll down some, we notice that um, then we have some more information, some more kind of content, uh, which kind of indicates that they probably did do some SEO writing. Um, but I'm not sure how the, the content ranks. Frankly, I'd be glad to see those numbers. Um, we see some of the two options we have over here, um, showing produce, showing different flowers. What they should be doing is actually showing pictures of the product in use. When you first look at the site, you kind of get the impression that it's just a bag, and this bag actually uh, preserves your product. But what you realize, as we, if I think we went to a different page, to the Order Now page, is what we realized that it's not actually, and we had to scroll, then click Order Now again. So now we're three, almost four clicks in, till we finally realized, after clicking on an image, this is click five that it's not a Ziploc bag, it's actually a package that you can put in any box, Ziploc bag or anything like that. And so, which is a great product, phenomenal product, um, a very poor execution of um, the sale for the site. It took five clicks to get here just to find out what kind of product it was. Not good for the user um, and, and not good for the bottom line. So that's conversions. You wanna improve your conversions, go back to the homepage for a second. Uh, make the, the, the big banner you have, you should feature those products there. Maybe before and after images, definitely, maybe even video of someone putting that product in the bag and storing it with some sort of video testimony. Time-lapse video, side by side. Time-lapse video, great idea. Uh, of, of the product being in use, add some contact information. Let people know you are a real company. They can contact you. Even if, even if you're overseas, frankly, at least people want to know they can mail a letter and they can pick up the phone. So that's conversions. Let's look at SEO. If we go to SEO Quake, uh, a plugin for Firefox or Chrome, uh, one of our favorite tools to use. SEO Quake for, um, this is for the order page? Yes, sir. Um, yeah. So SEO Quake is a tool you use in the browser. It kind of tells us what's happening on the back end, how much content you have, um, um, which keywords are you targeting, um, how many pages have been indexed, things like that. So according to SEO Quake, um, um, bag buddy, better for the environment, better for your wallet. Your title um, is branding your, your, your product name and your company name, but it doesn't say anything about uh, preserving freshness or, or preserving produce and things like that. And essentially, that's probably what people are going to search. I don't think people are going to search bag buddy. Frankly, the image had it being used in a box. May want to investigate that or research that. Um, no meta keywords, um, no big ding for that. Um, Google doesn't pay much attention to them. Um, um, uh, Bing does. Meta description, which is a duplicate of the title. That's not good. That meta description should be unique to each page you have. Um, your page rank is zero. Um, I actually thought it was going to be non-applicable. Um, no robots file, no sitemap. So just some SEO basics that would probably um, improve your placement. 273 words total on the home page. Not bad, but if we look at some of the two or three word phrases, home order now, um, um, home order now about, how to use, compare, there aren't really phrases in your content that are strung together that theme your content around your target phrase, which I'm assuming would be uh, produce freshness or keep produce fresh or or something similar to that, not necessarily bag buddy. 
So um, uh, work on your content. If we can go back to the site, I would say work on your content. Uh, make sure that it that it does have the keyword you want in it. Uh, work on your your sales process. Make sure that people can find exactly what that product is um, easier and add some contact information. Um, so that was a re uh, website analysis for Bag Buddy. If you want to get your website um, analyzed, <laughs> go to e-webstyle.com, uh, fill out the free website analysis form, and uh, we'll analyze your site. Until next time.